and welcome! I'm Rupert Cooper and this is the Rupert Cooper Show. So, as you can see, we're looking a bit different today. So, coming up today, we play Guess the Person. We discuss which app is the best for making rotors or timetables on your laptop. We discuss whether or not we might be getting a new presenter. We tell you what app I use to, to make, edit and make my videos. And, as usual, we do the weather. All coming up after this. Recording from RTV Television Studios in Batley, this is The Rupert Cooper Show. With me, Rupert Cooper. So shall we get started with the show? So to get started, we are discussing whether or not we are getting a new presenter. So some people have been putting comments in asking if there's going to be a new presenter. Well, not for now, but we might start having some guests on the show soon. But I can't promise anything yet, but I can definitely say there are new, no new presenters coming. Do you know, I'm not really happy today because I'm filming today instead of watching Saturday Night Takeaway. I know I'm filming for tomorrow, but I know. Still, after I've done this, I might I might get watching Ant and Deck on, a, on ITV. Saturday Night Takeaway, watch it on ITV or on ITV Hub. It is an amazing show, so make sure you watch it. Anyways... But I, yeah, I can definitely say there are no presenters coming on the show for now. We might in a few months, in fact, in a few years. But, I mean, it's the whole reason why it's called the Rupert Cooper Show, because, well, Rupert Cooper. But it's not the Rupert Cooper Show without guests. So I can't say it's the Rupert Cooper Show without guests, because I can't really, because that's not the name. And their name is the Rupert Cooper Show. And we do have guests on the show sometime. Well, we haven't had any yet. But we might be getting some this week, seeing as it is the holidays. Anyway, before I can get a breath in. <laughs> after I can get a breath in, sorry. Still to come on today's show. We discuss which apps I used to make my videos or edit my videos um, and much more coming up on the Rupert Cooper show. But first, here's this. So shall we start discussing? These are the apps, some of the apps uh, that I use to edit my videos. I use InShot, iMovie, Boomerang and YouTube Studio. So that's four things. There are many more apps for editing. You can have editing apps on your laptop. You can have editing apps on your phone. You can have editing apps on your iPad and you can have editing apps on any other device you can think of. Um, these are the same really. I only use three of them. I use, well, I use them all, but I only use regularly two of them, actually. Uh, I use InShot and YouTube Studio. iMovie I use to make advertisements, really, because, well iMovie I'm not it's not not good but it's better for making adverts than making uh, actual television shows if you know what I mean yeah so if you want to try some of these to make your own show as good as mine um you can send me it in and I'll give you a link just email it to 
R-U-P-C-R-R at yahoo.com. That is my email and if you email it in, you probably will get a comment back from me. Make sure you put your name as something uh, as a uh, a fan or something or uh, it'll go into spam. 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 Right. So, I'm cracking. Still to come, we play Guess the Person. Oh, and much more coming up after the entertainment intro. In some people. So here is the first person. Play the first person. So we have a comment in here. So we have a comment in here from Jessica in Westminster. Is it Jake on Hunter Street, which is on Nickelodeon? Let's have a look. That's the correct answer. Well done, Jessica. Right, here is the next person. Play the second person, please. Here is another comment that says, everybody knows this Rupert, it's Phoebe Thunderman, again off Nickelodeon. Are they that easy? Anyway, that is the correct answer. Right then, here's the last person. Play the last person, please. Well, not play, but show the last person, please. And we have a comment in here saying, I don't know who it is, but is that Sam's friend off Victor, uh, I, um, off Sam and Cat? No, it is not. It is Sam's friend off iCarly. That's the clue that I'm giving. Oh, we've already got a comment in anyway. Is it Carly off iCarly? Yes, it is. That is the correct answer. If you want a full name, well, you're going to have to look on the internet. Yeah, Carly Shay. That's her name. Um, yeah, so... Uh, for more things like this, send me some comments in at rupku at yahoo.com. R-U-P-C-O-O at Y-A-H-O-O dot C-R-M. Um, right, still to go and we discuss which app is the best for making rotors or timetables. And we do the weather. All coming up today, still on the Rupert Cooper show. So, let's start discussing which app is better for making rotors or timetables. So, we have some comments in saying which apps are the best. So, here are the comments. The first one says Microsoft PowerPoint. Um, this, uh, I say some people think Microsoft Excel is the best for making rotors, but it isn't. It's the best for making lists. The real best is, there. in fact, there's actually two. Well, the real best is Microsoft PowerPoint. And the second best is Microsoft Word. Um, Mainly Microsoft PowerPoint, yeah, uh, because you can like move images and rotors around. But on Word, it's got headers and footers at, at, at the top and the bottom. Uh, so you can't really move stuff around as much. Or I say you can't move stuff around as much. You can, but it's complicated. Uh, so, um, yeah. I think I'm saying that. I don't know whether you'd be able to or not. I'll have to have a look at 
that for you. And I'll get back to you on the next show. Um, but anyhow, we have some uh, comments saying just about the same as me about Word and PowerPoint. They've been the same. Right then. Let's move on. Shall we do the weather then? But first, here's this. Right then. After Storm Eunice and Dudley, some damage has been done. Um. I will get to that in a minute, but first here's today's local weather. So in Northern Ireland, Scotland and Northern England we'll see rain, clear to leave sunny spells and sharp showers. Wales and Southern England will have heavy rain throughout the day. A very windy day to today. So hold on to those uh, hats and scarves and everything that's loose on you. If you were going out cycling on a hill I would watch out because you might get blown down right then so now let's get to it the damage done by Storm Eunice so here are some lorries have jackknifed on the motorway lorries have turned turn over I don't know if you saw it in weight Yells. I don't know if you saw it in Wales but um. Um, the top of a, a church fell, like literally just fell off. Luckily no one was injured, but these winds have brought many things and a few lives have been taken because of Storm Eunice. Uh, Storm Dudley wasn't as bad as Eunice, but um, if it is starting to show signs of a storm, I would make sure you either cut down the driving on the motorway um, or you watch out whilst you're driving. So, anyways, uh, we've nearly come to the end of the show. Here is uh, actually my dad to tell you what uh, uh, to tell you that he will be on my show next time. But first, here's another one of the Rupert Cooper show intros. Well, I don't know what that means anyway. Anyway, here it is. Recording from RTV Television Studios in Batley, this is The Rupert Cooper Show. With me, Rupert Cooper. Unfortunately, my dad hasn't been able to make it today, but he will definitely be starring on my show as a guest next week. Well, not next week, but on the next show. So, from us all here at the Rupert Cooper show, have a really nice day. If I can find it. No. Um, from us all here at the Rupert Cooper show, have a lovely day. Good night. Well, not good night, good afternoon, then good night, <laughs> bye bye.